M0FXB. So we've got the uh, Bofeng now connected by USB to the computer. The one that we purchased was uh, the lead we got was a fiver, and um, we had it came with a CD. But in the end, I just went to the uh, just Googled driver, and that was actually the easiest way to install it. So all we do now, we're just going to put in our frequency, which is um, let's get it right. Okay, so having a check, making sure I'm setting things up correctly. So um, let's go back to memories. So memories here, I've copy and pasted my frequency, which is four three four dot. 400 tone squelch 118.8 all low power FM I literally just did one and then copy and paste it all the way down and I went down to settings and if you can look here I basically unticked virtually everything left Vox at 2 speech level squelch level 3 monitor and 300 seconds here for timeout and then I've gone file uh, upload to radio and which you get now the way I found found my radio, I literally just I don't think the driver even installed properly. I literally just plugged it into Windows 10, went to d Device Manager, and there it was on uh, on Com 9. So I thought, well, that's quite lucky. And I just see the way it says CH340, which is is the driver's number. So maybe I already had it on there. So right, we've sent that to the radio. Now what we're going to do? We're actually going to test the radio. So we've got the uh, the two radios, both programmed with the same frequency. So if I just talk into the the Bofeng now, hello, 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 and uh, take it from me, you can hear me. One, two, one, two, one. I've got, I've tested it outside. One, two. So it works that way. And then if we go back the other way, so the FT70 talking to the Bofeng. Hello, 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 and you can uh, you can definitely hear me going into it there. So. Uh, yeah, that's all ready to go into the um, all-star node. So 7-3 for now.